seed starting. You know, so many people out there think that's what they want to do, grow their own plants right from a seed. It's nice, it's romantic, but is it for you? First thing I want you to ask yourself is, do I have enough time to take care of these seedlings? Second thing I want you to ask yourself is, do I have enough space in my property? And then the third, do you really need that many plants? Tomatoes, for instance, you only need one plant to feed up to four people. Next, when it comes to seed starting, what do you need to know? First off, you wanna make sure you're starting your seeds on time. That is the number one reason for failure. Remember, tomato seeds, six to eight weeks before last frost date. That means almost the first week of April in Toronto is when you should be starting your seeds. Next up, make sure that you have the right soil. And as well, when you're seeding them into a tray like these, always put two seeds per cell instead of just one. If one fails, you always got the other one coming. And then finally, moisture and heat. That's what you need for seeds to germinate. So if you have moisture and heat, you don't need light until they have two leaves. Once they have two leaves, that's when you need to put them in the light. Seed starting 101. Ask yourself, is it for you?